everyone who meets Ray just falls in love with him. He's just such a gentleman. I love his generosity, his loyalty, his unconditional love, just his big heart. Things I love most about Jess would definitely have to be her warm and compassionate personality. She got a contagious big smile. And, you know, whenever I'm stressed or upset, all she needs to do is just smile, and you know, things are better. You know, she's the one that I want to be with forever. I knew Ray was the one way before the proposal. The proposal was uh, was something else. So I thought to myself, what's the craziest thing someone can do? You know what? We've never been skydiving. After I had booked it, I had to convince Jess to do it. Next day, Saturday, went to Wollongong, spent the day there, nervous as hell. Not because I was just about to propose, but also because I was jumping out of a plane. I was so scared because I'm petrified of heights. So the instructor that was with Ray said, Ray, we're going to go first and I was shaking. It was the scariest thing to see your loved one jump out of a plane. And my heart was pounding, I'm shaking thinking about it. And I get to the edge and I jump out. It was the most amazing experience I think I've ever had. So as I was coming down, the instructor behind me says to me, Jess, can you see what's down there? So I looked down and then I could just read this sign saying, will you marry me? And it was like an out of body experience, like from jumping out of a plane and now I'm getting proposed to. So I don't even remember landing. I just remember being on the floor and standing up turned around and raised there on his knee. This is not someone and he said to me, Jess, will you marry me? And I said, of course I will. And it was just the most amazing proposal any girl could ask for. So my best man is my younger brother Richard. We are very much different, but at the same time very much alike. There'd be no one else in the world who'd be my best man other than him. My mum and dad mean everything to me. I am the person I am because of them and because of their dedication and selflessness to me and to my brothers and sisters. They, they mean everything to me and I hope I can make them as happy as they've made me throughout my life. I'm the only girl and I'm the eldest of three and everyone knows I'm daddy's little girl. I love my dad more than anything in this world. He has supported me through everything for the last 26 years and he will always have a special part in my heart, him and mum. If I could become half the woman she is, I think Ray would be a very, very happy man. And I'm so blessed to, to have parents like that and to be brought up in a home like the one I was brought up in. I love you. I love you. I love you too. To my amazing Jess, I cannot believe that today has come. A day I will never forget. I promise to always make you as happy as you have made me today. And I promise to always love you more tomorrow than I love you today. I'll see you at the altar. I love you.
first moment I'm looking forward to the most is seeing Jess walk into the church for the first time. She's going to look amazing. It'll definitely be breathtaking. I think my heart is going to skip a few beats. Raymond, beloved son, do you take this handmaid of God, Jessica, here present as your wife? I do, Father. And you, Jessica, faithful daughter, do you take this servant of God, Raymond, here present? I do, Father. I just want to say I'm so excited to be marrying you. You're my best friend, my soulmate. I love you and I could not imagine my life without you. This has been an amazing journey with you, babe, and I can't wait to see what's to come.